The Taipei Fine Arts Museum has in its collection this painting, Backyard, by Lu Tiezhou. It is one of two paintings by Lu entered in the Fifth Taiwan Art Exhibition in 1931. The other painting is lost, so luckily Backyard remains at the Taipei Fine Arts Museum. The basis of Backyard is the hollyhock and the red common mallow. Then there are also corn plants and palm trees. A black hen is seen leading five chicks in a casual manner. Look closely at how the hen holds a worm in its beak. You can see a little black chick on the far right flapping its wings excitedly trying to get to the worm. Such details make the subjects look almost human. This work by Liu Tiezhou was completed after he finished his studies in Japan and was returning to Taiwan with new ideas. The style takes in Maruyama Shizouha of Japan's painting from nature. It is a style that is like the dyeing of very elegant colors. He also added some plants native to southern Taiwan. He added some interesting little lifelike details like the hen and the chicks. He also added butterflies and bees dancing among the flowers. This kind of work is very pleasing to the eye. The development of Liu Tiezhou's work has to do with his life experience. He had previously owned an embroidery shop, so he has a very sophisticated way of using color. For example, the leaves of the hollyhock show protrusions on the surface. It's almost like they were embroidered with silk cloth. The ground in the foreground feels as if it is covered with real soil. The feeling is as if the whole painting was done using embroidery. So this work by Lü incorporates his artistic development of craft and skill. It is a precious and remarkable work that is still kept to this day. He did not forget his former styles after coming back from Japan, the kind of traditional and Chinese style of painting, as in his painting Tiger from 1932. It is of a more traditional kind of work in ink. This painting on a hanging scroll was more like the work he was previously doing as a professional painter. and the kind of tiger paintings that traditional Taiwanese painters would have in their collection. It's very obvious that it was not drawn from life. It was more a technique developed in traditional Taiwanese art form of using running script. If Liu Tiezhou were to open a painting class, his works could become rough sketches because there is a market for them. Finally, let's look at the hanging scroll painting, Formosan Blue Magpie. The background is relatively simple, and the painting is very pleasing to the eye. It uses the Nihonga technique, which is the same as traditional Chinese ink paintings. In this Formosan Blue Magpie painting, the body of the bird appears as if embroidered, It is also a life painting, except that among all his depictions of the Formosan blue magpie, this one is the most elegant and the most still, even though the magpie is supposedly a bird of prey. Most of Liu's paintings of the bird display extravagant motion. They would either show the bird turned around or with the tail tilted up, but this one is different. This one has its long tail hanging straight down. 
This is juxtaposed with leaves and flower buds pointing upward. It shows equal balance between up and down motions. This makes it an elegant painting where you can see calm within motion and vice versa. Among all the works of Liu Tiezhou, this one is considered very special. Thank you.